We now know the name of the man who opened fire Tuesday at an Oregon mall full of holiday shoppers. Police say 22-year-old Jake Roberts stole the rifle that he used to kill two people and himself. But they don't yet understand why he did it. John Blackstone is at the Clackamas Town Center just outside Portland. John, good morning. Good morning. Well, as tragic as the shooting was at this mall with two dead and one more seriously wounded, there's a realization here that it could have been much worse. The gunman came loaded with enough ammunition for a slaughter, but why he did it remains a mystery to his friends. On his Facebook page, Jake Roberts can be seen smiling and happy, and that is the man Sean Stone says he's known for a year and a half. He was shocked when he learned Roberts was the shooter. I could not believe, and it was like my heart sank into my feet, and I'm getting a little choked up <sighs> looking for some comfort in whatever the truth might be. Stone says he and Robert sometimes went shooting together. One photo shows Roberts with a handgun. This is what we did when we were target shooting. But Roberts targets at the mall with the thousands of people getting ready for the holiday. Roberts entered the mall through Macy's and headed for the food court. It was there he first opened fire with a semi-automatic AR-15 rifle, killing Cindy Yule, a shopper, and Stephen Forsythe, who had a business at the mall. Then Roberts moved to a service stairwell. At some point, his gun jammed, but he got it working again, and on the lower floor of the mall, turned the gun on himself. 22 minutes after the shooting started, officers found him dead. They also found a third victim. A bullet had ripped into the chest of 15-year-old Christina Shevchenko. Trauma surgeon saved her life. There may well have been more deaths and injuries here, but uh, mall workers and law enforcement had recently drilled uh, for an event just like this at this mall. Uh, the mall went into lockdown very quickly. Thousands of shoppers were taken to a safe place out of the line of fire of the shooter, and that may have helped save lives here. Charlie and Gail. John Blackstone, we thank you. No